Hi everybody, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you a filter uh, called Reshade. This uh, software comes in particularly handy when you play old like retro style games that have a lot of pixels in it. This will allow you to smooth the graphics up and make it look a lot better. So we are going to head over to whatever browser we're using, type in Reshade. Okay, you're going to click on either of the two links here. Uh, either Reshade up here. Normally this is the working site but for some reason it's down right now so I found that, that by clicking on here I was able to download it so go to download download whatever is the current version at the time that's gonna put it in your downloads directory once you have it downloaded the cool thing with this is you do not need to install a program it is an executable file so I would just recommend you put it in a folder and you know run it from there so I'm gonna jump to that directory on my hard drive and we're going to be using a game called uh, Shantae, Shantae Risky's Revenge. Uh, it's a really nice game. Uh, it does have like old school graphics with so uh, basically a lot of pixels in it. So we're going to use this to uh, smooth the, uh, the graphics up. So you're going to run the program. You're going to go and click on Browse and maneuver to whatever folder your game is inside. So in this case, I'm going to Mines. We're going to click on the executable file. Open that up. Now, nine times out of ten, it's going to find the you know correct API for you. If it does not, you can always look online or just keep trying until you know you see that the program works, and uh, you'll see what I mean here in a second. So once you have the API uh, correctly picked, you're going to hit next. You're going to click on next again. Now, the ones that I use, and these are the best ones to make the graphics smooth, pick uh, Sweet FX. So you're going to make sure that's checked. You're going to scroll down and pick legacy effects you're going to hit next again now you're going to see a whole slew of filters on here you're going to click uncheck all the ones we want to use for this specific game is crt so uncheck all then click just uh, crt effects click next again it's going to take you to the second uh, option you're going to uncheck again and you're going to pick hq4x.fx so click on both of those. Once you're done, you're going to get to this window. You're going to click Finish. Okay, we'll travel to the folder where that's in. We're going to go ahead and launch the game. And if you see this option here, the software should be working. So you're going to hit the Home key. Click on Continue. Continue. Then you're going to uh, make sure advanced CRT is highlighted and also HQ4X. Now, as you can see, you already see the uh, difference on the game and the menu. So we're going to hit, hit continue. And then we're going to change this setting here, which says strength. Or that one you can actually leave as is it is for now. We're going to go scroll up resolution amount we're going to change to about 7,000 and something and you'll notice how it makes the changes on the screen so let's just take a few seconds here actually you know what let's run it without this first so you can see the difference As you can see, it's pretty neat graphics, but you see how they're pixelated. Okay, so once again, we're going to hit home. We're going to pick the ones I said earlier, Advanced CRT, HQ4X. You can already see it smoothed it out. I like to disable these two here because it, it kind of makes the scan lines pop a little bit more. So oversample off and also the other one. And as you can see, the game looks a lot smoother now. And you have a slight effect of the scan lines on there, which makes the game look a lot better. All right, so once you're done, you're gonna go ahead and close out of that. Just hit escape again. And as you can see, the game looks real nice and smooth. Smooth graphics. All right, I hope that comes in handy for you guys. If you like the video, uh, please subscribe and hit a thumbs up for me. You guys have a great day.